Howdy folks, got another clean water store instructional startup video. This is for the 5900 BT Bluetooth valve. This is for the Air Charger series. Uh, we're going to assemble the bypass, which is really easy to do on this unit. You're going to notice this is the inlet valve. There's an air check valve that prevents the air from escaping back out. That's what's letting you know it's on the inlet side of the valve. And this is where your incoming water supply goes into. This first threaded connection, it, it comes like this. You might want to unloosen that and make sure there's lubricant there. And then you're going to grab your bypass piece. And so we can see this a little bit better. I'm going to turn it to this side now. You got the bypass assembly here and there's directional arrows on it that tell you what side goes in and out. And again, you've got uh, O-rings right there. You get a little pack of lubricant, make sure that they've got some lube on them if they're not lubed already. And very easily push the uh, O-ring fittings in and then screw the fittings tight. That's the bypass assembly and the last thing we're going to do is the connectors that you're going to hook up your service pipe to. Again, make sure there's lube on the uh, O-ring. Push it in and get them tight. And have them matching in. Now you got your incoming water going down through the filter, coming out the clean side. If you have the valves turned in that way, filter is now bypassed and the water is going in and out. You still have water in the home but it's not going in to the uh, filter anymore. The whole thing is designed to have some play and wibble wobble, not the part on the valve there, but the, uh, the three connections between here and here and here. It's supposed to have a little bit of play so don't try to over tighten them. It'll make a watertight seal with those o-rings. Thanks folks!